The second year of the Marcos administration finds the Philippines at a crossroads. Despite promises of unity and progress, the nation seems more divided than ever. Economic woes, unresolved conflicts and a foreign policy seemingly detached from the needs of its people have left many Filipinos disillusioned and uncertain about the future. The administration inherited a nation grappling with the aftermath of the pandemic and ongoing economic challenges. Yet instead of decisive action to alleviate these burdens, the focus appears to have shifted towards external affairs and military agreements, leaving many to question the government's priorities. As the nation navigates these turbulent waters, one question remains. Will the Marcos administration chart a course towards stability and prosperity? Or will it continue down a path of uncertainty and discontent? The most pressing concern for ordinary Filipinos is the escalating cost of living, particularly the rising prices of basic commodities. Food, the cornerstone of any household budget, has become increasingly inaccessible for many. The price of rice, a staple food in the Philippines, has reached unprecedented levels, pushing it beyond the reach of low-income families. This food security crisis is not merely a matter of supply and demand. It is a complex issue rooted in structural problems within the agricultural sector. Decades of neglect, lack of support for local farmers and an over-reliance on imports have created a fragile system vulnerable to external shocks. The current administration's policies have done little to alleviate this crisis. The lack of concrete measures to address rising food costs and support local agriculture has left many Filipinos struggling to put food on the table. At the heart of the food security crisis are the Filipino farmers, the backbone of the nation's food supply. They face numerous challenges, including rising production costs, lack of access to credit and technology, and the influx of cheap imported produce. These factors have made it increasingly difficult for them to make a living and sustain their livelihoods. Despite promises of support and development for the agricultural sector, the government's actions have fallen short. Limited investment in infrastructure, research and development has hindered the sector's growth and modernization. The lack of effective policies to protect local farmers from unfair competition has further exacerbated their plight. The neglect of the agricultural sector not only threatens the nation's food security, but also undermines the livelihoods of millions of Filipinos who depend on it.